Good morning, everybody. It's Midnight and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of Undertale. In the last episode, we got to the friendly little ghosty's house. I don't know if that's his official name or if he even has one, but that's what I'm calling him. We also got to supposedly the entranceway to Waterfalls, where we're headed. Or now we're going to Hotland. I guess we're in Waterfall. And now we're headed to Hotland. Uh, unknown Temi Village. So, how exactly do we ac access that place? Gotta like go up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, circle, X, uh, options. I don't think so. We're just gonna keep going this way. We got ourselves another box, and, uh, forget if I actually- Hello! What the fruit is this thing? Whoa there! I got some neat junk for sale! Uh, it's a shop. A crab apple. Uh, heals 18 HP, looks like a crab. Uh, CT heals 10 HP, speed up in battle. Uh... I feel like that would be difficult. Like, I assume it makes the heart quicker. I feel like that would make it more difficult. Like, I accidentally run into things more easily. I don't know. Uh, armor. Uh, five defense. Minus five defense. What? Invincible longer. So, is it good or bad for me? Uh, let's see. Weapon, two attack, minus five attack. I believe that means like minus five like currently, so the things I have right now are stronger than this, so I shouldn't take them. Yeah, like a torn notebook as a weapon? Invincible longer? What are you looking for? I don't think I want anything from you. Hey, I'm trying to get rid of my junk, not get more of it. Though I've heard if you want to sell stuff, the Chemi Village is your best bet. Where is it? I don't remember. So, Temi Village is the only way we could sell things. Anything you want to know? Let's see about yourself. I've been around for a long time, maybe too long. Studying history sure is easy when you've lived through so much of it yourself. <laughs> uh, that emblem. Eh, hey, you don't know what that is? What are they teaching you kids in school nowadays? <laughs> That's the Delta Rune, the emblem of our kingdom. The kingdom of monsters. <laughs> Great name, huh? It's as I always say. Old King Fluffy Buns can't name for beans. And my emblem's meaning new. No! That emblem actually predates written history. The original meaning has been lost to time. All we know is that the triangle symbolizes monsters below and the winged circle above symbolizes something else. Most people say it's the, uh, the angel from the prophecy. Oh, there's new stuff still. Oh yeah, the prophecy. The legend has it, an angel who has seen the service will descend from above and bring us freedom. Lately, the people have been taking a bleaker outlook, calling that winged circle the angel of death, a harbinger of destruction waiting for us to free from this mortal realm. In my opinion, when I see that little circle, I just think it looks neat. <laughs> How about the king? King Fluffy Buns, he's a friendly, happy-go-lucky kind of guy. If you keep walking around long enough, you'll probably meet him. He loves to walk around and talk to people. Eh, why do I call Dreamer Fluffy Buns? Oh, that's a great story. I don't remember it. <laughs> but if you come back much later, I'm sure I'll have remembered by then. I'm sure he literally will remember it much later, and it's just a funny piece of dialogue. About Undyne. Undyne, yeah, she's a local hero around here. Though through grit and determination alone, she fought her way to the top of the Royal Guard. Actually, she just came through the here asking about someone who just looked like you, just like you. I'd watch your back, kid, and buy some items. It might just save your hide. Wah! <laughs> interesting, interesting. Be careful out there, kid. So we gotta find our way to Temi Village so we can start selling some jank, because I'm running out of room in my inventory and in my box inventory. Uh, what does this say? Hurt, beaten, and fearful for our lives, we surrendered the to the humans. Seven of their greatest magicians sealed us underground with a magic spell. Anything can enter through the seal, but only beings with a powerful soul can leave. There is only one way to reserve, reverse the spell. If a huge power equivalent to seven human souls attacks the barrier, it will be destroyed. Uh, there's always seven of Sultan or eight of Sultan. Now, what was going southward do? Was it a dead end? Probably, yes! Nothing here of interest. Good to know. Unless there's like a secret. Come on, there's never gonna be like a nothing option. Uh, whatever. Guess we're just gonna keep going. So, I finally picked up Blade Strangers yesterday. I'm so stinking happy. I'm happy that I was able to easily get the box art and keychain I was looking for because 
The game had three different uh, box arts, uh, one for Kawase, one for Curly Brace, one for Quote. I wanted to get the one for Curly just because like it looked the least tech. Like Kawase just stands out too much, and then obviously I love Curly a million times more than Quote, so uh, I wanted to go with the Curly box art. And uh, with the keychain, uh, you could either have Solange or uh, Kawase, and gee, I wonder which one I want, the Kota Princess one or the not Kota Princess one. I feel like I talked about this, so I apologize if I'm repeating myself. But the guy at the GameStop is actually very, very nice with uh, helping me get them, and I really much appreciate that. Uh, so that was very nice of him to allow me to pick which one I wanted and uh, switch around the keychains to make sure I got the ones I wanted. The only thing that kind of got messed up is uh, Special Enemy Temi appears here to defeat you. Uh, I know who you are because, again, fan gamer merchandise. Uh, you're a keychain of some sort. I, I feel like, I don't know why, but I feel like if I so much as breathe on you, you're gonna die. Um, Flex, feed Temi talk, wait, feed Temi flakes, what? Temi only wants the Temi flakes. No, so hunger dies, what? What the fruit is that? Oh my god, what the heck? Temi forgot her other attack. Uh, can I leave now? Uh, flex, you flex at Temi. No, muscles are not cute! Oh, I have to disagree. No! And she's dead. Just the two of us, huh? Oh my god, I actually summoned him? God darn it. Oh, jeez. Okay, so Aaron is here again. How do I beat him again? I just have to hurt him enough times. And I'm sweating. Okay. Yep, here come the sweat. Just avoid it. Avoid Parkinson's. But yeah, um, the only thing that didn't I wasn't able to get was that for both Code of Princess EX and uh, Blade Strangers, there is a, a special sticker that comes on the box, uh, on the wrapping. The, uh, for Code of Princess, it was Zozo, and for Blade Strangers, it was Solange. It's just a special goodies inside. Um, I kept the Zozo sticker. I just uh, stuck it to the inside of my Code of Princess box, but... Um, for Blade Strangers, the Solange one came torn, like it was all like scratched up and ripped off, so it was really unfortunate and I'm very sad about it. So uh, I'm gonna see if I can somehow get a Solange sticker from a plastic wrapping to see if that's even a thing that could happen, I don't even know. Uh, if you're watching this and you got yourself a Solange sticker, send it over to good old Uncle Midnight because I really want one. I'm gonna try like contacting Nicholas and see if they uh, would do such a thing if I like print or introduce myself as the world's biggest Code of Princess fan because I will fight for that title. I don't care what anyone says. Uh, just keep on going here and another enemy. Uh, gee, okay. I wonder if there's any like there's gotta be like some sort of wow that was very quick. Oh wait, hmm, it's very normal. I was about to say like I wonder if there's any like a uh, secret to the mold songs because like why are they still here and they just die so quickly? Uh, flirt. You wiggle your hips suddenly. Ooh, well, there's the secret. Oh, jeez. Yeah, oh god. Oh god. Why, 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 why is he so evil? Mold boy, you need some distance. Uh, I'd unhug? You don't hug Moldy Bug. It appreciates your respect of its boundaries. <laughs> Apparently, not enough to not attack me. Okay, okay, okay. And spare. You won. That was something. Uh, go back up here, and we're good. Oh, got another sign. Without candles or magic to guide their home, the monsters use crystals to navigate. Okay, I guess that's what we're doing right now. And oh god, it's really dark. Oh no 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 no! I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Hi. Oh god. Oh, this could only end poorly. Oh, uh, fooey. And an enemy. Uh, stink and wash one, Aaron. Let's, uh, clean. Wash it to clean you. That's very excitedly. Yes, I know how this works. Oh, wait, the blue ones are good. But only if I'm not moving. Uh, god darn it. Uh, mercy. Education, hobby, talent. I don't care, stink and Aaron. Aaron's annoying. Oh, jeez. Get out of here. Oh, god, that was a close one. Fight. Yeah, that's gonna need another attack. God darn it, I jumped the gun. I like jumped the ballet slipper. Uh, very good. Uh, nope. Let's 
We'll do one more attack. No need for a swimming suit. A swimming suit. I don't think I've ever heard someone called a swimming suit. Usually just a swimsuit. Oh, come on. There you go. Let's go downward. Oh, why is this a thing? Wait, do I have a crystal of some kind? No. I was wondering, like, if that would help me get through here, but... Uh, okay, I'm going this way. This way. I'm sure there's an HMO5 around here somewhere that I could have used to make this a bit easier on me. Seems I'm making some sort of progress, though. I uh, just want to keep going to, like, the right, because we came from the left, so I assume the exit's going to eventually be on the right. Uh, we're at the wall. And we made it! Cool. Oh, uh, this could only end badly. Uh, is this a hole? No, it's not. Hmm. Anything we could do around here? Uh, hello? Behind you! Oh, hello, Undyne. Seven. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer. Oh, they're the same person. Of course they are. We'll become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface, be it back from humanity, and give them back to suffering and and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Undyne, I'll help you fight! Yo! You did it! Undyne is right in front of you! You've got front row seats to her fight! Wait... Who's she fighting? Hey! You aren't gonna tell my parents about this, are you? Um... You aren't going to tell my parents about this, are you? Um... So... Do we go back? Ever so conveniently, it's all lit up now, so we can walk around. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm, if I say my wish, you promise you won't laugh at me? You hear a passing conversation, of course I won't laugh. Someday, I'd like to climb this mountain we're all buried under. Standing under the sky, looking at the world all around, that's my wish. Your laughter. Hey, you said you wouldn't laugh at it. Sorry, it's just funny. That's my wish, too. However, there is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface, they will return and the underground will go empty. Feeling something crazy is about to happen. Yeah, oh, I'm singing sick of you. What? What do you want? Hurry up. Like as bad as the giant fish. Yo, I know I'm not supposed to be here, but I want to. I want to ask you something. Man, I've never had to ask anyone this before. Um, yo, you're human, right? Haha. <laughs> Man, I knew it. Well, I know it now. I mean. Undyne told me, um, stay away from that human. So, like, um, I guess that makes us enemies or something. But I kind of stink at that. Haha. <laughs> Yo, say something mean so I could hate you. Please? Uh... What if I say no? Yo, what? So I have to do it? Here goes nothing. Yo, I... I hate your guts. Man, I... I'm such a turd. <laughs> I'm gonna go home now. Oh, yo, wait, help, I tripped. 
Uh oh. That was me, right? I actually did that. Or was that a cutscene? Yo, dude! If, if you want to hurt my friend, you're gonna have to get through me first! Oh wow, really? She won't fight other monsters. She's gone. Yo, you really saved my skin! Guess being enemies was just a nice thought. Haha. <laughs> we'll just have to be friends instead. Man, I should really go home. I bet my parents are worried or sick about me. I bet if I let him fall, then I would have to fight Undyne right now. Later, dude! Okay. So that just happened. Kind of regret saving him just because he's annoying as heck, and this is a dead end. Okay. Is this the. No, it can't be the exit. Oh, now you're magically up here. Seven. Seven human souls, and Cain Asgore will become a god. Six. That's how many we have collected thus far. How convenient! Understand? Through your seventh and final soul, this world will be transformed. First, however, as, it's, as is customary for those who make it this far, I shall tell you the tragic tale of our people. It all started long ago. No, you know what? Screw it! <laughs> Why should I tell that story when you're about to die? Yeah! You! You're standing in the way of everybody's hopes and dreams. Alphys' history books made me think humans were compassionate. But you? You're just a remorseless criminal. You wander through the caverns, attacking anyone in your path. They attack me! Self-defense, please. You didn't kill them because you had to. I didn't kill any- well, except Toriel. You killed them because it was easy for you. Because it was fun for you. Do you think it was fun when I found out? Do you think it's fun when people's family members never come home? Is that fun? No. But your time's up, villain. You won't hurt anyone else. A knight in shining armor has appeared. And all the pain you inflicted on the fallen, every hope, every dream you've turned to dust, she's gonna send right back through her spear. Yeah! I'll tell, I'll show you how determined monsters truly are. Come on, step forward and let's end this. Oh, ever so conveniently a safe star. Let's go ahead and do it. The wind is howling and you're filled with determination. Save the game and get ready for the fight of our lives. That's it then. No more running away. Here I come! On guard. What does a green heart mean? Oh Jesus, Undyne attacks. Oh, this is some awesome music, I'll say that much. Uh, Undyne, plead challenge. I don't want to do either. Plead. I told Undyne you didn't want to fight. Nothing happened. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face danger head on. You won't last a second against me. Uh. Huh. Okay. Uh, challenge? If you tell Undyne her attacks are too easy, she doesn't care. Oh, I said face towards danger. I meant face towards the bullets. Okay, thanks for telling me. Huh. So, this is actually too easy. I want to fight, nothing happened. Bad, then how about this? Uh, flashes a menacing smile. Okay, let's just see how strong my attacks are. 62, and wow, she's got a lot of HP. For years, we've dreamed of a happy ending. Uh, I actually prefer this style of fighting better because it's easy. I like it because it's easy. Holds her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Uh, hit, hit, hit. Now sunlight is just within our reach. Pew, 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 And then flips her spear impatiently. <laughs> I won't let you snatch it away from us. 
I don't know what I think, I don't know, this is a weird topic to bring up now, but I don't know what I think about the backgrounds. Like, the fact that every character is black and white when you come into these battle things, I kind of wish there were colored backgrounds and uh, colored character sprites. Like, in a certain other game that this game is heavily inspired from. But whatevs, I guess it's just a style. Enough warming up! Oh god, this is actually really hard. Okay, oh, and she turned me into a regular heart again. And then flashes a menacing smile, uh... Uh, I can't do any of those, so just keep attacking, I guess? Hey, you're tough. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. I liked it better when I was just deflecting attacks! Uh, and I'm points heroically up towards the sky. I told Endyne you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Even if you could beat me. Uh, just jumping around the spears. Oh, God. Oh, come on. Okay, green again. Suplex is a huge boulder just because she can. Uh... Wait, what, the bolts are gonna get faster? What? Uh, no human has ever made it past Asgore. Okay... Undyne Towers threateningly. Pew, pew, pew. Honestly, killing you now is an act of mercy. Not really, what the heck? Oh, come on! Uh, let's see, item, what do I got? How about a bicycle? Eat one half of the bicycle, you're covered 11 HP. And she's running out of things to say. Uh, how about the other half? A unicycle? <laughs> oh my god, that's thinking funny. Eat the unicycle, you're covered 11 HP. So stop being so darn resilient. Oh god, you're getting angry. Uh, so it'd actually be a good time for, uh, to use the control stick instead of the buttons! Uh, I just realized. Uh, Undyne suplex the huge boulders because you can. Uh, plead. Well, no, you didn't want to fight. Nothing happened. Oh, what the heck are humans made of? A bunch of meat and water and fear and deception. <laughs> uh, then bounces impatiently. <laughs> Anyone else would be dead by now. Yeah, you got that right. Oh, jeez. Just keep on avoiding. Okay, we're good. Undyne sequels a huge boulder, just because you can. Oh, wait, what? I keep on skipping it, like, her text become a little less extreme. Alpha told me humans were determined. What the fruit? Ugh! It smells like sushi. Please. I told Undyne you didn't want to fight. Nothing happened. You see now what she meant by that. Oh my god, it's so confusing. I don't know how I'm supposed to dodge that. Uh, switch to huge boulder. Uh, let's have another bicycle. You wanna have the bicycle? You recover 11 HP. I'm determined to. Oh god, so many arrows, so many arrows, so many arrows. Oh god. Okay. Plead. I told you didn't want to fight, but nothing happened. Determined to end this right now. Okay, I'm sort of understanding it. Watch some menacing smile. Sometimes their attacks are too easy. The bullets get faster. Jesus Christ. Right now! Uh, flips your spear impatiently. Right now. Yes, I get it. You're oh, jeez. I think she's just gonna keep on saying that. She draws her finger across her neck. Haha. -ha. And now it's slow again. Uh... Yeah, die already, a little brat. Uh, okay, so she was just being like impatient, like saying, "Why isn't you dying?" Or I was like, "I'm gonna finish this right now, right now." It's like me when I'm like, "This battle is." Oh, I actually just died. I didn't realize how much how low on HP I was. Game over. Cannot give up just yet. Human, stay determined. The safe star's gone? That's it then. No more running away. Here I come. So, I was always wondering like what a game over would be like if it would actually like cause something to happen. 
Uh, guess not. Um, I was wondering if like getting game overs would change the story in some way, but it didn't apparently. Also, this is a weird looking sprite, just like a bunch of lines, and that's Arc Shield. Uh, we can't skip through the text this time. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, actually I did that way too early. Okay, just gonna have to zoom through this again, so I don't know what else I can talk about. I can talk about Blade Stranger some more, but no. I'm just gonna keep on trying to do this. Eh, eh, eh. Now suddenly it's just within our reach. Uh, hope the victory was just within my reach. I assume I just have to keep on attacking, because that's what worked with Papyrus, but... The thing with Toriel didn't work, I just, I magically got a million damage on the, like, with one attack, and that killed her. That is not stinking fair. Ugh. Why couldn't it work with, like, anyone else? Like, I'd be fine with killing this person, like, accidentally, but... Oh, jeez, so much stinking damage. Ugh, go to 57, just strong, oh god. Pew, pew, pew. 64. Okay, go around. Oh, jeez. Uh, by the way, in case anyone's wondering, like, what, uh, dis what's the deciding factor on whether or not I get voice actors for LPs? Uh, because this is a blind LP, I wouldn't want to get voice actors for it because I it would interfere with like my reactions to certain things. So, um, for that reason, I don't get voice actors, and then also. Uh, it's also just good for me to practice voice acting in general and whatnot. If this wasn't blind, then I would be uh, voice acting this trying to make it look like a cinematic experience. But because it's blind, I am just going in a full-blown wiener. Uh, maybe if I redo the LP in the future, then I will uh, have voice actors for it. But no one's taking the role of Papyrus away from me, just so you know. 54. Uh, stop being so darn resilient. Okay. Uh, keep going. Oh, jeez! God darn it! I hate everything! Huh! Uh, where's the unicycle? Eat that unicycle! Oh, yeah! The heck are humans made of? Eyelashes! What the fruit? That's a new attack! Oh, come on! What the fruit? Uh. uh, let's try another bicycle. Must be dead by now, okay. Just go around, avoid all the arrows. Oh jeez, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, that was too early. 51, Alice told humans were determined. Okay, I'm getting good at it. Uh, uh, uh. I see now what humans are made of. Now, I'll show you what I really made of. Taking so stinking long. Yeah, I know you're determined too. We're all stinking determined around here. I wonder if just like rotating around uh, crazy like will always guarantee my safety. I doubt it. Determined to end this right now. Uh, sometimes, not all the time. Let's go ahead and eat a s unicycle. Eat the unicycle. Recover 11 HP right now. Right here. Do -na -na -na, right there. Do -na -na -na. Okay. Oh, that was a critical right there, right now. Oh, come on. So close to being perfect. Okay. Haha. Is there any like difference to like why some of them turn red or something? Dog residue, astro food. Okay, eat the astronaut food. <clears throat> <laughs> I can't breathe. Die already, a little brat. Okay. Wait, what? Why is it? Why is it sometimes they go? I don't know. Oh, jeez. Why is this so terrifying? Huh. Oh, come on. Uh, uh, uh. 55, you're getting in my way. Uh, just jump around, 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 jump around. Jump around. Okay. Oh, Jesus, no! 130! I'll not be defeated. Okay. Uh, what is it with the... I guess Critical is just random and I just got horrifically unlucky with Toriel. So, maybe there was a way to save her? I don't know. I'm just always gonna be hung up on that. No, wait, my damage is just getting more and more. You'll never escape from me. Okay, I think that means I could run away now. 
Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. When just howling, spare- I could flee. Escaped. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, run, 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 run! Stop running away! Run! Oh jeez. Welcome to heck. Come back here, you little punk! No, thank you. Just gonna keep going. Welcome to ho to Hotland. I was like hotel land. I swear to God. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking, you, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would be great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. Click. No, thank you. Come to Hotland. I actually know where our house is, but we're not gonna go there. Sans, help me! Why did I stop to talk to him? Oh god, why is she stopping to talk to him? What the fruit? Armor. So hot. But I can't give up. And there's ever so conveniently a water cooler here. Gee, I wonder what I'm supposed to do with this. Take a cup of water? Yes. And give it to Undyne, because I'm stupid. I'm going to regret it. Huh. Classy. Very, very classy. And the background changed again. Oh boy, seeing such a strange laboratory in a place like this? You are filled with determination! We made it out of our fight with Undyne. Unscathed, sort of, aside from that one game over. But we're gonna end it off right here, right now. Next time on Undertale, we are going to explore Hotland! Very creative name. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night.